Others wanna cut me down. Hello. You know, I'm, I think I'm a bit okay with feet. <laughs> not as a fetish, but as like, I don't, I'm not disgusted by feet. I'm gonna make a drink. Happy Pride Month! I recently posted a video asking for brands to include me in LGBTQ campaigns. Let's do some gay stuff to get the brands. Very selfish thing to ask. That's where Libra & Co comes in. Libra & Co have done a very generous thing. The remainder of Pride Month, they're gonna donate 20% of their sales of this passion fruit syrup to an LGBTQ charity of my choice. Isn't that just the best? I chose the Trevor Project. They focus on suicide prevention for LGBTQ teens. And that's just awesome. All of this is awesome. If you wanna buy a bottle of this, you can. Link in my bio. And use the code Pride with Nick to let them know I sent you. And if you like, how do I use that passion fruit syrup in a cocktail. Let me show you just one way. Let's make a porn star martini. Two ounces of vanilla vodka, one and a half ounces of passion fruit liqueur. Make sure you spill it everywhere. Half an ounce of lime juice or lemon juice. So the same thing. And one ounce of the gayest passion fruit syrup on the market. Add ice to your shaker, as always. One scoop of regular ice, one big boy. Liquid into ice, bit of a slam. We'll start slow, feel the pressure, fashions itself together, and we really just go for it. Okay, right. Break that seal. Now I normally hate martini glasses, but look how pretty that one is. Pop your strainer on and double strain. And before we garnish it, we'll clean up a little bit. Because we're respectful in this house. And this is a gay porn star martini. Hey, cheers. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. I'll admit, before this evening, I'd never tried a porn star martini. That's banging. But maybe it's just the gayness. Buy yourself some passion fruit syrup. Support the Trevor Project. Support Lieber & Co. I'm gonna drink this and walk over here. Good evening. I'm a fat. I've got glasses on. April Fools. I don't have glasses. I'm a little boy. Proof. Proof I'm a little boy. I've had COVID now for about four or five days. And, and no one talks about this when it comes to COVID. COVID dreams are, they're like flu dreams. But flu dreams are normally because you're like on drugs to make you better. COVID dreams just come no matter what, and they're terrifying, and they're like lucid dreams, but awful. Anyway, every single one I've had for the last four or five days, every single terrifying COVID dream I've had has been about Veronica not letting a certain man in. That man, Veronica, that guy, has been in my head every single night and then I wake up and then I have COVID and it's still bad. You know what? You're doing great, okay? Thank you. Now for all you people watching at home, Nick is actually gay, which is unusual for a skier in these parts. Although I like to deny it.